everyone, it's Rosie and I'm back. Welcome to my channel. And if you haven't done so, would you please subscribe to my channel and become a member of our family here? And today I have these little headband here. It's a bee and I'm going to be a bee for Halloween with my little baby um, doggy Elsa and she has her costume already but I just wanted to put the little ears here <laughs> and um, just uh, be festive for Halloween anyway um, I have a combined Dollar General and Dollar Tree haul so without further ado I'm going to start with the Dollar Tree items and then I'm going to work my way um, through Dollar General and Dollar General is mainly all Christmas, okay? So let's get right into this. Now, the first few items I did purchase were these acrylic paints. These are by Rich Art, and this is in a bright red. I, just, I wanted the more Christmas red, so I purchased this one. I also picked up this uh, in the same brand. Oops, looks like somebody got into this already, but anyway, um, it is a pink paint, and it's a bright fuchsia pink. And this is the blue, and it's a very pretty, like, um, I'm not, not a cobalt blue, but it's a, a very pretty blue. And I thought that was nice. And these are, let's see how many, four fluid ounces in the acrylic paints. And they do dry uh, pretty quick, so... That's what I like about them, and I like to do them, uh, use them for my projects. <laughs> the next little um, thing I got was um, from the DT, was this Color Your Own Decor, and it is by Crafter Square Christmas Items. And I don't know if you could see that, but it says Be Merry, and it's um, a little, looks like almost like a little Volkswagen or a Pinto <laughs> from back in the day with the little Christmas tree on the top does come with these markers. I'm not sure if I'm going to use the markers, but um, I like to use the paint on these. It shows up a little bit better. And since I did get the red, it'll be the little red, you know, car or van, whatever it is. <laughs> and um, I'm going to use that. It's plain on the back, so you can do your own drawing if you want. But I'm going to use this and decorate it. So another item I picked up from the Dollar Tree was this, um, it is the Wired Garland Ties, and it comes with 12 pieces, and that's what it looks like. And this is Christmas House. It's a brand from the Dollar Tree. And I did get this to um, fill up the little Dollar Tree Christmas trees that are like um, just a two foot, like they're 24 inches. And um, I use those and I tie it around, eat, you know, and make it look a little fuller. So for $2, you have yourself a nice little tree for tabletop or a little decoration. So um, I use that for that. <laughs> and I have bought that um, in the past last year. So it's not really a new item, but um, I just wanted to pick up another one. And... Um, the next few items from the Dollar Tree are food items. And I don't generally use, uh, actually show food items because, let's face it, sometimes it can be a little boring. But, you know, hey, I, I'll, I'll put them in there. <laughs> so the first item I picked up is, I've seen everybody haul these. They're these scrumptious cookies. And this is the chocolate with the peanut butter inside. So that looks delicious, and there's six in a pack, and i um, not sure if they're individually wrapped, it doesn't say, but um, it is a 3.4 ounce box, so I picked one of these up to try it. The next item I've seen before it is by Bud's Best Cookies, and these are made in the USA. And they are maple cream cookies. So that sounded delicious, and I wanted to give these a try. Sometimes you want something a little sweet, but you don't want, like, you know, anything really heavy. So these little cookies, I think, would do the trick. Um, and they're the maple cookies. 
So, and they have a little filling in them, as you can see there. So I just wanted to try them. I've seen them there, you know, in the past, and I haven't picked them up, but um, I wanted to give them a try. Now, this next item, I was floored to find this because this is a box of Russell Stover. Now, look at this box, how big it is. Usually, they come the little miniature size boxes for Christmas and every holiday they put them out. And they only bring like four or five little candies in it. This is a Russell Stover Cherry Cordials Rich Milk and Dark Chocolate Candies. And this is a, looks like a 5.25 ounce box. So look at this. I mean, this is a nice size. So I bought actually four of these. I'm going to keep these on hand. Um, you know, maybe as an additional Christmas gift. You could put this in a gift card or, you know, just add little items. Maybe, uh, you know, your imagination, it, you can do whatever. <laughs> so I just wanted to pick these up. Actually, I got four of them. So I thought this was a great deal for a dollar. Russell Stover name brand chocolates. How awesome is that? <laughs> so the next items, I'm so excited. Um, I did go to Dollar General. Um, I think it was last week. Yes, last week. And I picked up some Christmas items. I've seen a lot of people do the dual um, like Christmas stuff from Dollar Tree and then Dollar General. So I wanted to see what Dollar General had for um, Christmas items. I know I've gone there in the past. Um, last year, I picked up a few items. So um, this year, I said, you know, why don't I give them a try again and see what's up there? <laughs> so the first item I got, I am so happy that I found this. <laughs> Look at this. I love dogs. They are my favorite. But they also have little kitties. Uh, I mean, they're cute there, too. Look at that. Window clings, and they're all christmas and look at the little wiener dog and the little um golden retrievers and the little kitty cats and all kind of doggies on there and the pug and, the, and it says merry christmas and this one peace joy and lots of chew toys <laughs> that's so cute on the bottom isn't that adorable so I thought this was so cute. And you know, you guys, another um, quick little DIY trick that you can use for these. Um, you can actually get those um, tall, like slim uh, candles that come in glass. They look, I mean, they're just plain. You can get the plain white or whatever color. And you can actually um, put this on the front, glue it on, whatever, my Podge it, whatever. Um, put a nice little bow and ribbon, put a little bit of the holly berries and, you know, like a floral pick on the top and tie a ribbon. Makes a beautiful and expensive gift. So just think out of the box um, and, you know, you can use these for that. So I'm not sure if I'm going to do that. I might show it on the channel. Um, not sure, but I just thought that's an idea. <laughs> now moving right along, um, along the red truck. And look at it, it has that buffalo check, the red and the black buffalo check. Isn't that gorgeous? And it says, have yourself a merry little Christmas. And it's a stocking. And this was just a dollar, just like the window clings, they were a dollar. So all that I picked up from Dollar General were just a dollar, just like at the Dollar Tree. But um, I thought I would show you those, you know, in case you wanted to go there and pick some items up. So that's that. And that's like a felt material. It's not anything fancy. Um, the next item I was so happy to find. And the buffalo check. Look at that. Oh my gosh. The red truck with the, um, the wood like on the back. And the buffalo check. White and black. And it is plastic. But isn't that cute? I thought that was so pretty. And this was a dollar too. So I really love this one. It's very pretty. And um, the next few items are like little decor pieces and um, ornaments. <laughs> so the first one is 
Merry and Bright, and it's the beautiful red cardinal for Christmas. Now, isn't that pretty with all that little, like, berries and holly on there? I thought that was so pretty. And this was a dollar. So this um, cardinal, they say that when you see a red cardinal, um, it is one of your loved ones coming to visit. So I think that is so sweet. And I always look to um, see if there's a red cardinal. And um, an interesting thing that happened um, on the day of my mom's um, funeral, um, our funeral ceremony that we were having, um, on that day, right when we were leaving, I was living in an apartment. I was going down the stairs with my daughters. And, you know, we were distraught and, you know, just sad. And all of a sudden, I see this beautiful red cardinal, and it's in the bushes. And it just stayed there for a good while till we got out. And even when we were walking, it just stayed there. And I thought that was just a beautiful little, like, hello, I'm here. I'm never going to leave you. And, ooh, I'm going to get teary-eyed. Um, ooh, <laughs> for the death... The anniversary of her death, passing, I'll say, is on November 12th, and um, it's going to be eight years, and it just seems like yesterday, but, you know, our moms are always here in our heart, so that's why I love Cardinals. <laughs> anyway, um, let me get to the rest of these, because I've got a few to get through. i got to show you guys these awesome ones from... Dollar General. Now, this one, I was floored that it was only a dollar. I thought it was going to be three or five dollars. I mean, look at that. Isn't that pretty? I mean, it's, you know, that pressed kind of cardboardy thing, but it says love, hope, peace, and Christmas, and it's in the shape of a tree. Isn't that gorgeous? It looks like the, um, like farmhouse decor can go with you could put it on your um, trees or a tear tray or hang it up as decoration. And maybe you, uh, when you work in a cubicle in an office setting, um, just something really cute. Or you can attach this to a nice gift for someone um, with a gift card again or something like that. You know, think along those lines. Very pretty. The next one I was floored that was a dollar also is this little decor piece. And it says, believe in the magic of Christmas. And it looks like a little easel, almost like those signs that you'd see outside of a restaurant or a business. And look at, it has the little stand in the back for a dollar. Look at, isn't that adorable? I think that is so cute. And you could set it down somewhere, uh, again, on a tiered tray or as decor anywhere in an office. Just so cute. And I love the same. <laughs> the next item I purchased is also a beautiful, like, little... This is an ornament. And it is very farmhouse. Look at that. Isn't that adorable? It looks like a galvanized, like, milk jug. And it says, all roads lead home for the holidays. Isn't that the truth? <laughs> And look at that beautiful little plaid bow. And it has a little um, pine cone there. The little holly. Just so cute. These are a dollar. <laughs> I don't think they'll last that long at Dollar General, to be honest. And neither will this one. I mean, this one is so pretty. You, you know, this rivals Dollar Tree. I'm just saying, this one... Looks better than the one that Dollar Tree was carrying. Just saying. <laughs> but it is gorgeous. Because it has the greenery on here. And the little plaid bow. And it says home for the holidays. That is beautiful. And it looks like a, tr a door. Or the front entrance with the, the little wreath on it. Isn't that gorgeous? I thought that was so pretty. So, I think that is it for my um, Dollar General items. So, I will be posting another video, hopefully, this weekend. Um, most likely on Sunday. 
and that will have more Christmas and other items that I picked up. I just don't have them all right here with me. But um, I did go to the Dollar Tree. And yeah, I went over budget. But I love the items that I got. And I'm not disappointed at all, as usual. <laughs> so anyway, guys, I hope you have a wonderful, happy, and safe Halloween especially if you're going out with the kids you know i know here in new york state we, we you know can't go trick-or-treating but even if you're going to family or friends you know be careful make sure kids are wearing reflective things out so that they're seen outside and um you know mainly just stay in if you're you have little ones you could still have like a little pizza party um order some pizza in or make some yourself have little drinks and little snacks, make up a little, like, little, I don't know, like a little party, watch, uh, you know, little cartoon movies, whatever the kids like, and have them dress up, take pictures, you know, pose for them, go outside and fall, you know, in the daytime and take pictures with all the, you know, fall leaves and everything, and just have fun. Even if the kids can't go trick-or-treating, um, you know, here in upstate New York, um, they're saying, you know, don't do it. And our cases are up on the rise here um, where we live. So, um, yeah. But anyway, you can still make it fun. <laughs> anyway, this is Rosie. Take care. Um, please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. And hit the notification bell on your way out so you're notified every time I upload. Thank you and have a blessed day. Bye-bye.